Welcome back. So, buy and sell it. That would be selling. Selling three legendary animal pelts. If you have already done hunting with Arthur and hunted down five legendary animals, you've achieved something that is a part of getting 100%. Now, this you can do with John. It was kind of fun. I decided to hunt down the legendary cougar, the pronghorn, and the Takanata buffalo in one day. And all three would count to the five legendary animals you would need in order to get 100% complete. Since I already did stuff with Arthur, this is kind of superfluous, but again, it was kind of fun. So let's get on with the first animal, the legendary cougar. Now, the legendary cougar appears outside of Tumbleweed somewhere. And once you enter its area, you have to start looking for it. Now, I had tried before, and it killed John. And when John came back to life, it was unavailable. So you might want to save before you hunt the legendary cougar, since it is the only animal that can kill John. You can just always reload and continue hunting the legendary cougar. But let's continue on with this current hunt for the legendary cougar. Well, you're not here. Close now. Well, that went a lot easier than expected, and I can still craft the legendary cougar fang trinket at the fence and put the pelt on the back of Rachel. Next will be the legendary pronghorn, and the reason I'm doing it in this order is I just started farthest west, moved east, and you can start with the Takanata bison and work your way west because you can shove the cougar pelt and the pronghorn pelt under the bison pelt. But again, start at the far west, work your way east. It's a little more fun. So on to the legendary pronghorn. Slow now.
got something. Still ways off, I reckon. Not here. Tracks real fresh. Now, the legendary pronghorn trinket prevents animal corpses from rotting, I believe. Not a big deal because I don't do a lot of hunting anymore after this. But it is fun to craft the trinkets and feel at least when I get to 100% I did something of value. So on to the legendary Takanata Buffalo. Easy now. What's this then? Still a ways off. Catch up to you. Close.
All three pelts secured. John can ride up to the trapper and get the or sell the pelts. And to be honest with you, some extra money and trying to craft the trinkets. I, you know, you can just go to the fence in Saint Denis or in Emerald Station and have them craft the. Uh, trinkets. And I'm just saving the game because, well, I want to save my progress and I'm getting damn close to that. Uh, how shall I say? Ooh, zoom out here. You can kind of see where the bison is located and the general area. But let's get over to the trapper and just sell off the items. Sundries tailored. Welcome back. So, buying or selling? All right, let's have a look. Once in a lifetime, eh? That's $103.50 in John's pocket. And he managed to get three legendary animals in one day. I'm Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment. If you found this video informative, hit the thumbs up button. Feel free to leave some comments. If you like this type of video, hit the subscribe button and bell icon. I post four video game related videos a week, plus some shorts and specials, and you don't want to miss out. As always, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing, and thanks for stopping by.